up. Let's go to um our division picks. Then after we give our division picks, we're gonna give our soup quick quick soup bowl pick, and we're gonna get up out of here, man. Uh let's start off. Um in let me see what I got right here. We're gonna start off with the East. NFC East. The Philadelphia Eagles are the defending champions. Uh I'm going with the Eagles to win this division. Of course, you can never really, uh, you know, really, you know, tell how the NFC East is going to um, play out every year. But I think they're going to be, I think they're going to be right in it. Like I don't really see there's any other team from a from a um, talent wise who can compete with them, and even quarterback wise, I think he's far 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 ahead the best quarterback in the NFC East. Got a great defense, um, and I think that even guys like Devonta Smith are going to take it to the next level. So I'm gonna go. Um, that they're gonna be back to back NFC East champions. I agree. I got the Eagles. Yeah, I got Philly. Okay, let's move on to the next uh division in the NFC. We're going to go with the NFC South. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers are the defending champions, but Tom Brady is not coming through that door anymore. And that's I got the Atlanta Falcons winning the division. Oh wow, you are Homer. Not not, not even. I'm just this, this is I'm just telling you the offense has a lot of really, really good weapons. The defense, they rebuilt the, def- they rebuilt the defensive line. You bring in base to play safety. You got A.J. Terrell, so you got cornerbacks. Okuda got hurt, but he's going he's gonna to be back. So you got a solid secondary. And like I said, this division is ass. So I think they could win. But the, uh, the Bucks won it last year with eight games. I can see the Falcons going eight and nine and winning this division. Saints. I'm going who that? Saints. Yeah, who that? I'm going with the Saints, too. I think they got the better roster. I think this is probably the worst division in football. I don't know. AFC South might be worse. But both South divisions are god-awful. But I'm going to go with the Saints, man. I think their car is enough to win that half ass division. And I just don't trust any of them other teams like that. Um, NFC West, Niners are the defending champions. Uh, this is going to be an interesting division. I think it's going to be a two-team division between the Niners and the Seahawks. I don't think the Rams are going to be on shit. Obviously, the Cardinals are obviously tanking. But I think the Niners have enough to get it done. Uh, to win another division. The question for them is, can they win a division? Is can they win the whole fucking thing? But I'm going to go with the Niners. I'm going to go with the Seahawks. I think the Seahawks mm-hmm. going to okay. win that one. Uh, I got to go. I got to go Niners. I got to go Niners. I think, yeah, even though I'm not really too sold on Brock Purdy, that team is still very nice. Yeah. Um, now we go to our division, our beloved Chicago Bears, the NFC North. The Minnesota Vikings are the defending division champions. Everybody's high on the Detroit Lions. I am not high on the Detroit Lions. Everybody says, I want to see you from the Bears. I want to see you from the fucking Lions. I am going to go. Minnesota Vikings are going to win this division. I don't think that defense is that good, but I think the offense is going to still be great. Uh, Kirk Cousins is not an MVP, but he put up MVP numbers for the first half of the season, like really for the majority of the season last year. They got the best wide receiver in football, Justin Jefferson. They got Jordan Addison. I like the calls. I like what, uh, what they're doing offensively, and I think it'll be enough because I don't think the Bears are going to be there yet. I'm expecting Green Bay to be the worst team in the division, and I just don't trust Detroit, so I'm going with Minnesota. I'm going to go with the Bears on this one. Oh! I'm going to go with the Bears on this one. Oh, I think it's, okay. it's going to be – I think every team is going to be in it. But I think the Bears are going to be better than the advertised. And they're going to be one of those teams where we look at they're ahead of schedule. And there's no there's there's no problem with that. I think the Bears are ahead of schedule and they're going to win the division. And it's going to be a close race. Like down to the Yeah, I think it's going down to the week. I think it's going down to week 18. I won't hundred percent believe that. Matter of fact, my prediction is my prediction is that we're going to be Clinton Lambo. I think we're going to be stressed the fuck out. Because I believe that the last game of the season, Bears Packers will decide the NFC North crown. Mm. Mm. Yeah, that'd, that'd be fun season if that's the case. Um, I actually agree with Bang. I think the Bears are going to win this division because I think Jason Justin Fields is going to take that leap that we expect him to take. And um, I've been thinking this for about a month, month and a half. Um, I understand all the hype around Detroit, but again, like you said, it is the Lions at the end of the day. So I think it's going to be a battle for the division, but I think the Bears are going to take it because I think Justin Fields is going to take that leap as a passer that we expect. And I think a lot of that uh, falls on Getz as a play caller as well. But I think we're going to see both of them really grow and have amazing seasons. Well, I hope both of y'all are right, man. Um, NFC wild card. These are these are three guys I got. I'm gonna go Cowboys gonna grab a wild card spot. I think the Seahawks will grab a wild card spot, and I think the Lions will grab a wild card spot in the NFC. Who who y'all got? I I got Dallas um getting the wild card spot. 
Uh, Dallas, Green Bay. Um, mm, you got Green Bay getting one. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. I want to. Ch- <sighs> Dallas, Green Bay, and the Giants. Mm, okay. Yeah, I got I got Saints, Giants, Seahawks. Saints, Giants, Seahawks. Okay. As you I see, like I ain't the, got San Francisco making the making the playoffs. They do not. They may not play. That means that uh fucking Shanahan needs to get fucking fired. And I'm I'm waiting for that day because he's one of the most over. We talk about Sean Payton, nigga. That nigga's overrated. But um, let's move on to the AFC man. AFC East, the Bills are defending champions. Uh, this is gonna be a goddamn good division. Um, Bills, Jets, Dolphins, Patriots. I'm actually changing my pick. Actually, Courtney actually taught me out this week. I originally had Bills. I can't believe I'm saying this. I'm going with the Jets. I'm going with the Jets to win the, to win the AFCs. J-E-T-S, Jets, Jets, Jets. Yeah, I wanted to pick the Dolphins, but the Ramsey injury and then the other injury to the other cornerback. I'm going to go with Aaron Rodgers. You know, I, 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 and two is going to miss finally, some five games. Yeah, I, I can finally say things I've never said about Aaron Rodgers. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, uh, quarterback. What can I say? Um, AFC South. I mean, Jaguars, man. Like, what, what, yeah, Jaguars. What, what are we doing? What are we, what are we uh, doing? Yeah. Jacksonville Jaguars. It's gonna be a, a good year for for Trev. So, um, AFC West. Chiefs defending champions. Of course, we got the Raiders, Broncos, and Chargers. I'm going. I'm rolling with 15. G. Like, I'm I'm rolling with 15 to the wheel fall off. Chiefs. Yeah, Chiefs. Yeah, Chiefs. Chiefs. No discussion here, man. Uh, final division, AFC North. This is the, this is gonna be a brawl, man. I like all. Four. I think this is another one's gonna. I think both North divisions come down to the last week. Bengals defending uh, division champions. You got the Ravens. You got the Browns and the Steelers. Ah, man, I I, I want to go Ravens, especially because we don't know if Joe Burrow is going to be healthy. I can't I can't go against my man Joey B, man. I'm going I'm going to, I'm going with the Bengals again. Ravens. I'm going Ravens, bro. Yep, Ravens. Ravens. Y'all on the Raven flock. Y'all, y'all, y'all bro, rolling high. Ravens. I, I, Ravens. I think Zay, Zay and Odell finna light that bitch up. I, I, I truly believe it. That's gonna be fun to see, man. I'm definitely interested to see uh how that's gonna go. So let's go to our AFC wild cards, man. I'm going to uh go with uh Bills, Ravens, Chargers are my three wild card winners. I got the Bills, the Bengals, and the Chargers for mine. I got Bills, Bengals, and I'm going to go Titans. Titans? Who's even yeah. throwing the football I, over there? I, it don't matter. I think with Henry and Hopkins, <laughs> I think uh, the, uh, DeAndre still got enough left in that tank. Where he'll, he'll, he'll find a way to get open for Ryan, good old Tannehill. So okay. I got them squeaking in that last, that last wild card spot. Okay, I like I like that. So the Chargers uh, head coach is an idiot, so I can't pick them to do anything. I'm not gonna lie to you. Like it's it's tough for me to pick them because like I and I'm I'm a fan of the going forward on fourth down, but he just does a lot of dumb shit. So like I I he puts them in the position to fail a lot. I I, I agree with that. I can't I can't I don't know if I'm gonna go all the way with the Titans, but I, I think you bring good points up with the Chargers. Um, Super Bowl, who we got in the Super Bowl? Who's gonna be in Vegas? Who's gonna be the nastiest Super Bowl of all time? I got Eagles Jets, bro. I I agree with Mikey's Super Bowl pick. I think mm. Eagles Jets is going to be the Super Bowl. It's going to be a slobber knocker. In the words I of got Ross. the Eagles versus the Jacksonville Jaguars. Mm. Mm. Okay, you you real high on them niggas, nigga. I think I let me give you my hot take out right now. Trevor Lawrence for MVP. Trevor Lawrence for MVP. And Calvin Ridley <laughs> is going to. Burn to these niggas for suspending him. So yeah, yeah I got. It oh, I forgot about really. That, yeah, man, G. But nah, I got, I got, I got uh, Trevor Lawrence for MVP in Jacksonville Jaguars versus the Eagles. Okay, the Doug I'm Peterson be, Super Bowl. I'm gonna be cliche here, man, just because I'm not creative whatsoever. Uh, I think we're gonna have a rematch. <laughs> I just like I just I, I wanted to pick. I don't know who to pick out the out out the NFC like. And the AFC has a lot of good things, but I'm, I'm Pat to me is gonna be like with Brady. Like, can you beat him? Can you beat 15 when the Marvels on the line? And I just don't think nobody can do that. So I think the Chiefs will play the Eagles in a rematch, and they're going to win the whole thing again. Then we back to back, and they will officially be a dynasty. I got the Jacksonville Jaguars win the Super Bowl, y'all. Oh, 
Mm. Bro, it's gonna go out. You, I'm going so out. So Duval gonna be partying. Duval, Duval gonna, gonna be partying. Duval gonna be partying, man. I got the Jacksonville Jaguars winning the Super Bowl. And then Bears fans are gonna be crying about, well, Justin Fields can't even win the division. And you nah, already nah, nah, know nah, nah. where we're going, fam. Uh-huh. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yep. I, yep. You know, I got I got uh I got Jalen Hurst and the Eagles winning the Super Bowl. Okay. I think I think Jalen goes back and I think he gets when he beats he beats Aaron Rodgers in the Super Bowl. I'm going to come back and play this when he gets close to the Super Bowl to see exactly who was right, how far off we were in a couple months.